predicting the cycle and potential for future eruptions. Yellowstone's explosive history is recorded in layered volcanic deposits, crystal populations, and isotopic clocks. This analysis synthesizes how modern geochronology and petrogenetic tools reveal the timing, evolution, and dynamics of explosive events at Yellowstone and what those data imply about recurrence, pre-eruptive processes, and the limits of eruption prediction. Key Conclusions 1. High precision dating combined with petrological forensics constrains eruption tempo from timescales of millions of years down to years, decades before an eruption. 2. Petrogenesis at Yellowstone reflects long-lived magmatic differentiation with repeated rejuvenation by hotter, more mafic inputs. 3. While recurrence intervals can be estimated probabilistically, exact eruption prediction remains impossible. Instead, monitoring must focus on physical precursors that geochronology and petrogenesis help interpret. Background Why geochronology? Bults petrogenesis matter? Explosive volcanism at large silicic systems like Yellowstone leaves complex deposits, ignimbrites, fall layers, and dense rock inclusions. Geochronology gives absolute ages for these deposits and their constituent minerals. Petrogenesis decodes the processes. Magma recharge, crystal fractionation, crustal melting, volatile exsolution that create eruption-ready magmas. Combined, they reveal A. Eruption timing and frequency B. Magma assembly timescales and C physical triggers, the minimum data set needed to assess future eruption potential. Beneath the boiling earth, characterizing the temperature and composition of magmatic fluids in Yellowstone's shallow geothermal system, Yellowstone National Park sits atop one of the most complex geothermal systems on Earth, where deep magmatic processes feed an intricate network of hydrothermal circulation. Understanding the temperature and composition of magmatic fluids interacting with the shallow geothermal system is essential to predicting changes in thermal activity, geyser behavior, and even potential magmatic unrest. This analysis explores the geochemical and geophysical evidence that links deep magmatic sources to Yellowstone's surface hydrothermal features, revealing how temperature, pressure, and fluid composition define the park's unique and volatile subsurface environment. Introduction The Fiery Heart Beneath Yellowstone Beneath the seemingly tranquil beauty of Yellowstone lies a massive magmatic reservoir stretching several kilometers below the surface. This system drives the park's 10,000 hydrothermal features, geysers, fumaroles, hot springs and mud pots through the continuous release of magmatic gases and heat. However, the chemical and thermal signatures that connect deep magma to these surface systems remain under intense study. Recent research combining geochemical sampling, isotopic analysis, and seismic tomography has provided unprecedented insights into the pathways through which magmatic fluids ascend and evolve. The Yellowstone shallow geothermal system thus represents a dynamic interface where mantle-derived heat meets crustal fluid circulation, producing some of the most extreme temperature and chemical gradients observed on Earth. 